Welcome to my channel, Dr. Munshi Nasser Skill Tone. How are you, my dear learners? In this video, I'm going to talk about how to use Max QDA software for your qualitative analysis with audio transcription option. In my previous video, I have discussed the tutorial of Max QDA with the proper coding and memos and all those analyses. In this video, I'm going to give you a hands-on example with audio transcription option in more detail. So without further any delay, let's get started. Now my dear learners, in this video, I'm going to talk about the life satisfaction. This is my project. As you can see here that I have 500 documents in my project. You can see here that the interviews like New York, there are five or six interviewers, interviewees who, whom I interviewed and then you can see interviews from Indiana and interview transcript with audio. Okay, so all this information are given over here. I will go one by one and this is one of our joint project which is already given example in this particular Max QDA example. So let's me, let me show you, first of all, the interviews from New York. If I double click it, you can see here that this is the interview transcription and here is the code career career positive so if you go to that career positive this is the code positive then you can say how satisfied are you with your health then you can see positive health if you look at the health this is the code now here is another code called the auto code system so all these information, the all survey content was coded in the Max QDA by simply clicking this option new code. You can always highlight it and press the code highlighted and press this one code with a new code which means if you cl click this one it will appear and it will ask you to code and it, it, you can do the memos and everything in this particular case. So you can easily code because it is a thematic analysis. So you can code the themes and accordingly upload the survey questionnaires and code each and every sentences in each of those codes that you have created so that you can analyze the thematic, thematic part in later on. So this is how you can do it. For the coded version, you can add the memos, memos meaning that the information about the code in detail, what about the code, what it says and how it says, what does it mean, all those things. So you can do it very easily over here, okay. So this is what we have in the first, first part of the interviews from New York and each and every Jonah, George, Rubayan, Kim, all those information are given like positive, one of the code over here positive and then you can say career, this is one of the interview with main topics because I am already divided the codes under different themes. So this is one of the themes. So I have put those themes under this selection. Likewise, now from interviews from Indiana, same way. Now one of the example, interesting example is the interview transcript with audio. This is what we are focusing in this particular video. So if you click this one, you will see that interview Robert interview Robert okay so that is because the interview was taken to the Robert and the interview when he or she asking any question Robert how it answers as you can see here that this is the time stamp this is the time stamp if you click this one time stamp it will show you the time stamp where the Robert says this particular pro option very interestingly very nicely okay now the question is how do you do that if you close this one let me show you how you can do that what you can do is first go to the import and then you can see audio click the audio and then for example i am particularly taking participant number 18 click open it will ask you do you want to import a transcript associated with the following media file i don't have it so just say no once you say no the file already exists in folder external files because I am already doing it. So press yes and it will open up a audio file for me. As you can see here, this is the audio file for me. 
Now, if I minimize this one, if I go to the minimize this one, then you will see that there is an audio file for me over here. You can see this is the audio file. I mean the transcribe file. Now, let's assume that I would like to or I would like to transcribe from from 00, 0 to 0 0.6. So, what I can do here it says F7 start of the click and then this is the F f8 or end of, of this click so where you can just say here i am ending up the click just press ending up the click now you can see over here that that this the transcribe version right click on this particular case it says that transcribe just press transcribe and you can see here the time stamp is already there if you look at this one you can see here that the time span is up until 0.15 second right and now you can see here that you just play press and now you can hear and start writing your information over here whatever the information given here likewise you transcribe each and every single thing and then you can export this transcribe version into a document okay now i repeat the whole thing again you can always rewind the interval. You can use the time span. This is a setting. This is the automatic changing of the speaker. You can put the investigator and the researcher, moderator, person one, person two. You can put the name and change the name over here like this way. Okay. So if I repeat the whole thing again, you will see that I am going to the import, press the audio version, click the audio file, open up, say no. And then since I already have it, just say yes and it will over open the audio file in front of you. And then it also document for the transcription participant number 18 with the transcribe value. All you have to do, just press where you want to start and where you want to add. For example, this part, click this one and then play, listen and write down your transcripted version. That's it. This is how you can audio transcribe the max qda using max qda very very easily okay now you can see here now it's a complete report so you can always see the literature review also there you can literature review you can quote the literature review as well focus group discussion if you click it there is a focus group discussion transcript number one moderator will ask any question then the person who are participating in the focus group like locus uh, they will talk and you can just put it in the locus as a coded version focus group coded transcribe you can put it there focus group so you can put it the transcribe version of the focus group transcript this is the focus group transcript meaning that you recorded transcribe and then you put it in the focus group transcript information then you have a video also i have a video also you can always video transcribe i have a picture also you can do the picture trans uh, writing of the code then YouTube comment, Twitter comments, every single thing are here. So you can see here that every single thing you can easily do it by simply pressing the new code and create coding for each and every documents which you are doing the thematic analysis and upload the document, simply press the text and PDF version, click the here, it will open up your PDF or text and upload it for the analysis. Now, this is how you can do the audio transcript, you can write the interview, you can do the focus group discussion, everything. You can see over here focus group transcripts, you can click here, transcript with the time span, similarly click this one, you can upload the focus group transcription and it will appear just like the one here I share with you, focus group, code, beginning and this is how you, it works. Now, some of my learners might say that where to transcribe the information okay for instance if you want to transcribe it by automatic ai support you can use two of the uh, website for free one is called the meet the geek geek you go to the meet the geek this is the ai supported transcribe option you can see here i transcribe this one you can upload the meeting over here pass upload the meeting and then you can use this for free this version is for free 
to automatically transcribe meet the greek meet the greek go to the meet the greek ai and upload your audio file and transcribe very easily without paying a single money okay another one you can go is otter.ai otter.ai okay go to the otter.ai this is an interesting interesting website where you can upload your audio file and then transcribe it using the otter.ai platform very simple very easy you do not have to pay a single money to do the transcription audio transcription otter.ai and interestingly my dear learners if you go to the transcript version in the max qda you will see that from otter.ai there is an option where you can upload the transcribed version of the otter.ai directly to the max qda for your thematic analysis okay it's very very simple very very easy so if you can use otter.ai if you can use meet the greek your audio file can be transcribed very easily without manually writing anything if you want to do a manual writing you can go to the audio file then you upload the mp3 or any file that is audio file and then following my steps you can manually transcribe your audio file and then you have focus group transcription using same otter or from otter.ai or from meet the greek you can easily upload the file and then do the transcription accordingly this is how the max qda can help you to do the audio transcription focus group transcription also how to do it in this particular example it gives you and if you go to the home if you go to the open project you will see there are few example projects from example projects you can find the live satisfaction you can go to this live satisfaction and easily find out this project and follow the project all along and this is how you can work with max qda for audio transcription focus group transcription coding thematic analysis content analysis word cloud every single thing in this complete package you can have a look my previous video i have had that link in the video description box and this video will help you to understand other features of max qda in more detail for qualitative study thank you my dear learners i'll see you in the next tutorial Thank <laughs> you.